Well, Brian Yacona, you're about 20 minutes into your brand new shift here on New Center Main at 6. How are you feeling? I think it's going all right. Yeah? Do you disagree? I mean, we'll talk after the show, maybe. Yeah, it's still yeah. early. Yeah. <laughs> I was telling him I'm going to slip him report cards every day. Okay, one yeah. small update time. No, it's, it's wonderful to be here. And, you know, you have one opportunity, I think, in your career to follow in the footsteps of someone you grew up watching, mm. um, which is the case for me. I, I grew up here. I watched Pat and Cindy stand right here, as I know you did as well. Yeah. Um, so it's, it's just a highlight of a career to have the opportunity. So, uh, and to do it with people I consider friends. Um, so we were together 11 years ago here. We were. Right. That's yeah. wild. That's right. Yeah. So well, it's good to be back. Thank you for having me. Reunited. We're happy yeah. to have you back. <laughs> this guy is such a, such a nice guy that I come in today, and there's a card. You got yeah. the same yeah. card and a nice bottle of they red wine, unopened. Shame. No, right, of course not opened. Unopened. No. And I, mean, I was I like. I have a sip out of it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything about it. Please. So it said to me, you know, to start this journey, I'm like, wow, now I feel like a jerk. I got to oh, get no. something. Yeah, no, I'm going to get know. something. Tomorrow, tequila. I won't. <laughs> 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 welcome, Brian. We're excited to have you. And welcome back to Maine's weather, which had us only in the 20s today. We got to 32 officially in Portland. Blink and you missed it, though. It did not last long, and it's going to be cold again tonight. Temperatures in the single digits in the mountains and foothills, 10 or so as you head across the interior, and then teens along the coastline. Now, the models have been significantly warmer than this, but I chopped those uh, numbers down a lot because I don't see any reason it would be any warmer tonight compared to last night. If anything, maybe a little bit colder. So we start cold tomorrow. It's a mixture of sun and clouds. It's a quiet day. Temperatures are a little bit warmer than today, not by a huge margin here. We're talking, you know, maybe some mid 30s over southern Maine, maybe closer to 30 across northern Maine. And here comes our next storm on Wednesday. Interestingly, we talked about this last week. This storm is offshore right now, and it's going to loop back around, and get kicked back to us on Wednesday as some light snow over northern Maine and into down east Maine. Temperatures will be cold enough for that. As you head west, just a couple of snow showers and squalls possible on Wednesday, but there will be some light accumulation over down east Maine, one to three inches Tuesday night, Wednesday, coating to, to one inch in Bangor, then a coating possible for the rest of us. And that just depends whether or not one of these squall lines breaks off and gives you uh, a quick snow shower, but that's boring. The real story we're interested in is the storm on Friday, which looks like it's going to hit us. The question is where exactly is this rain snow line? Because that as it moves in on Friday into Friday afternoon, this low is just a little bit west for where you want a low to be. If you like snow along the coast, it's right over Boston. You want it out here or even better is out here, but we're not going to be picky. We just don't want it to be quite over Boston like this. So you can see what that does. Well, the latest model is bring rain uh, into the coastline and maybe the interior eventually. So right now I think there's a rain risk for the coast. We'll have to watch where that low goes. Snow likely in this pink area changing to rain. That's a possibility. And then snow is likely to be the case all the way through in the shaded blue area. There will be more than six inches of it. I was joking before I had a snowfall map in my head. And then the latest European model came in this afternoon, and I took that snowfall map and mentally crinkled it up and threw it in the wastebasket. <laughs> so we will wait another day to see what develops. There's definitely a storm there on Friday, and I, and I think that um, a lot of us will see snow. It's just a question, guys, of how long can we hold on to the snow, and that will certainly dictate the uh, kind of the severity or the intensity of the storm. All right, and it's going to linger around for a while. Yeah, it's, it's almost all day here. Friday and a lot of Saturday. All right, thanks, Keith.